Hey guys, it's me David. It's, it's still uh, 5.15, 2021. Saturday night, I'm sitting here having a couple drinks. Um, there was a little harassment going on. As soon as I took out the camera, they stopped. And then I shut the video off. And then they started again for a couple couple minutes. So, But they're scaring our dogs. Um, you know, Tanner gets so scared of fireworks. And it's May 15th. It's only May 15th. And they're already starting to shoot off fireworks. It it, it it's harassment um, towards me and my pets. And they like to scare. They don't care. These people do not care. They go over the line all the time. This guy, I'm telling you, he's a dumbass. This guy has been uh, taking my program down ever since he came on board five six years ago. You know, the guy doesn't know when to stop. He just doesn't know when to stop, you know. Just like when I uh, got tortured, um, you know, six months ago. Uh, well, from, I don't know, it was, well, I got tortured quite a bit last summer it, until um, January or February when I went to the hospital. The guy, I mean, if the guy didn't know I was going to go to the hospital, he was going to send me to the hospital, he's a dumbass. You know, they don't know when to stop. They don't know when to stop. You know, until uh, other people step in. Uh, like if I go to the hospital or something really bad happens, then someone big steps in, you know, and stuff. But, I mean, this guy, these people don't know when to stop. They keep on going and going and going over the line. They just keep on going, you know, until something bad happens. Or until you're in the hospital begging for help, you know. So they don't know when to stop, you know. So they're already lighting up fireworks, scaring our dogs. Tanner's timid enough as it is, and they are scaring him with these fireworks. He's laying right, he's laying right underneath the table, right by me, because he's scared. He looks scared, you know. You know, they don't care, you know. These people don't care about anything, you know. Something, something's going on. Something bigger is going on. Something bigger is going on. Um, I'm not going to call anybody a perp and all this stuff, but uh, there's stuff going on. This is coming out, you know, pulse radio frequencies, you know, RF frequencies. You know, on the news, on CNN, MSNBC, you know, these cable channels and all this stuff. All these mysterious attacks. Something is going on, you know. Um, billboards. You know, they're letting them put billboards up. Now they're supposed to put up two billboards in high traffic areas. They could stop that if they wanted to. They could they could put a stop to that in a heartbeat if they wanted to, you know. If they wanted to stop that, they could. That's how much power they have, you know. So, I don't know what's going on. I mean, it, it's like, it's like some people are letting this come out, you know, and... and and the torturers are, are probably going ape shit because they're, they're like, oh my god, I don't know what to do, it's coming out. You know, some, something bigger is going on. There's a, a, a gen, agenda happening, you know. It, it'll be an interesting summer. It's, it's going to be a really interesting summer, um, you know, if they put up billboards in high traffic areas, um, you know, if, I don't know if these attacks are going to continue, um, like I say, they, they need to know about TIs, uh, uh, these senators and, and congressmen and stuff, um, they need to know about TIs and what we're going through, um, there's something going on. You know, um, there's, there's, there's got to be a reason for this. Why are they letting it come out? I mean, they're, they're letting it come out. They, they own these cable news channels. 
You know, I mean, I mean, um, if they didn't want this to come out at all, they would, they can, they have the power to do that. But now it, it, it's, it's coming out, you know, they're talking about directed energy weapons, radio, you know, pulse radio frequencies that are hitting people. It's coming out, you know, w what's going on? You know, like I say, they have the power to, to shut it, shut this down. Um, they're letting them put billboards up. They're letting them put billboards up. You know, why are they letting them put billboards? They have the power to shut that down anytime they want. You know, they could they could shut Ella down and Matthew down, and uh, they could make them. They could shut them down. I've seen the power of these guys. Um, they can, if they didn't want it to come out, they could shut it down anytime they want, you know. So why are they letting it come out? I don't know why, you know. Um, there's something, something's going on. Something bigger is going on. Uh, maybe it's out of control where they can't control it. <coughs> you know, maybe there's too many of these contractors torturing people or something. I don't know. But they're talking about directed energy weapons on CNN and all these other channels. And, and, and they're hitting high-profile uh, government people to where this is coming out. You know, something's going on. Something's going on. Uh, maybe something big will happen this summer. I'm not going to get my hopes up, but maybe something big will happen this summer. Um, I'll tell you one thing. Um... These contractors are going to be thrown under the bus. They're going to be thrown so far under the bus because the government's going to say, we did not tell these people to do this. We know nothing about it. They're going to deny everything. They're going to say, it's these contractors. you know. And these contractors are being set up for a big fall. They're being set up for a great big fall. And their life is going to be ripped from them someday it's gonna happen you know so if they're married and have kids and a nice house and all this stuff it's gonna be ripped from them someday this is gonna happen mark my words it's gonna happen you know and that's what's gonna happen with these people and they use these low level pieces of crap to light off fireworks and you know they don't care you know and they want to call you out these meth heads want to call you out and fight you and you know and oh my god they got all their thugs out there why you know i'm just i'm one guy i'm one guy why do you have to have 10 perps on me you know are you that threatened by me why do you have to have 10 perps on one harmless guy that's sitting in his house you know i mean come on I don't know what's wrong with these people. I really don't. Anyway, so that's what's going on tonight. Um, other than that, it has been that bad of a day. I got out, went out for a couple of rides today and all this stuff. It's supposed to be super hot on Monday. I plan on taking Max out, probably going to the beach or going somewhere on Monday. Tomorrow's supposed to be not too bad. I'm trying to get. I'm gonna try to get Tanner out tomorrow. Uh, maybe go to the park. You know, just a short ride to the park because he gets so nervous. Um, you know, um, you know, the way I see it is, is that their time is almost up, you know, um, their time is almost up, uh, like I say, a Nazi war criminal got, um, extradited to Germany or wherever, well, I think it was Germany, <sighs> For, he was 98 years old. You know, they don't give a shit. If you're 80 or 90 years old, 60, 70 years old, this is going to catch up with you, and they don't give a shit. If you're in a damn wheelchair, they're going to convict you of this crime. It's going to it's gonna happen. It's going to happen. So these guys, they're having a fun time right now. They got a, a blank check, and they're torturing us, and harassing us, and all this stuff. This is going to catch up with them. It's going gonna, it's gonna to catch up with them when they're old and vulnerable. That's when it's going to catch up with them. You know, when in their golden years, the retirement years, you know, they're, they're retired. And they, oh, they think they beat the system and all this stuff. 
this will catch up with them. When they're an old man or an old woman, this will catch up with them. It always does. It always catches up with them. It always will. You know, I'll tell you something. We will go. We will go down. We will go down in the history books. We're, they're gonna. They're gonna make. They're. They're gonna. They're gonna. People are gonna be talking about us. In ten or fifteen years, they're gonna be talking about us, and we're gonna be well known, and we're gonna be in history books for what we've gone through. They're, the people are gonna be talking about us, and they're gonna know our names, what we've gone through. You know, and it's gonna happen someday. You know, that's the way I see it. Anyway, I'm gonna cut this off. I'm just chilling out. Um, you know, got the harassers out there. They stop when you film. And then when you shut the camera off, then they start again. So, you know, it's a cat and mouse game. And this is what they do, you know. So, anyway, I'm going to cut this off. I hope you guys are enjoying your weekend, enjoying a drink or something, or a beer or something. And uh, I'll talk to you guys later.